Hey everyone, this is Andrew Tai and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to launch Old World as a native M1 Apple Silicon application. So if you haven't subscribed already, then please consider subscribing. It just takes a moment to do and you'll be able to keep up to date with the latest Mac tutorials. So if you try to launch Old World at the time of recording, it's going to crash. And there is a workaround. What you can do is go to properties and you can go to local files and browse and then control click on the application and then launch this as a Rosetta application. And it's gonna bypass the crashing issue at the time of recording. However, there is another way of fixing this issue and that is by enrolling into the M1 beta. And so this is gonna allow us to run this as a native application. However, this is still in testing and it might not necessarily work, but if you're watching this in the future, it's probably gonna be incorporated into the Steam version of the game in the future. So the way to do this is we're gonna control click on Old World in the Steam library, and then we're gonna to go to properties. Then we're gonna go down to betas here and then we're going to enter an access code to unlock the private beta and these instructions come from this thread directly from the developer and all you need to do is to enter this beta code so it's test m1 mac fix i'm going to leave this in the description so we're going to copy and paste this into this area here and we're going to paste this code test m1 mac fix i'll leave this in the description as well i'm going to click check code and then we're going to opt into next version so what will happen is that this will do an update. So this is gonna be the beta update, which contains the fixes necessary for Old World. And once that's done, this will say Old World Next version instead of just Old World. So if you did apply the Rosetta 2 fix, then make sure to uncheck Open Using Rosetta and then close this. And then we're gonna go ahead and launch this now. And this has launched the native ARM version, which is still in testing at the time of recording. And you can see in Activity Monitor, this is the Apple type, which means that it's been optimized for the native M1 ARM chip. And now this strategy game is fully playable on the M1 chip and it's been optimized correctly. So anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like, please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.